and Austin Matthews. Craig Simpson scoring again with goals in each of his last two. What's not to like about this matchup? So even these two teams, both with 22 wins, one point apart, should be a good one. And Paul Maurice was a little concerned about this game when he saw it on the schedule coming off the extended road trip. Puck played in front of the net. Loose there. Hyman right on. And a stop by Hellebuck. Leafs with a couple of early looks in the opening 90 seconds. Working up deep for Nate Thompson, who scored in the last game for Winnipeg. Up high it goes. And Trevor Lewis couldn't get the shot off. Checked there by Spencer. Now one that ends up in the breadbasket of Jack Campbell. Adam Lowry up against Tavares, who won the draw for Toronto. Tavares over the line, Galchenyuk in. And that's stopped by Hellebuck, who holds on. Up ahead it goes to Austin Matthews, the goal-scoring leader. Stopped up along the boards by Forbert. Dubois can't get loose, and now Matthews in for Hyman. Marner in front of the backhand. Stop, rebound, scores. Austin Matthews has the kickstarter tonight, his 24th of the year. Get a note for the net. The nice job all on the boards. Forbert battling with Matthews. Puck stays alive there. Good job of Marner. Then watch the aggressive move here. Here's the big hit coming, and it missed Hyman. Knocked down Forbert. Hellebuck unable to control this one on the rebound. Right of reach there, and Matthews comes in and puts it in with Marner. They got their signals crossed. Kept in at the line by Riley. Nylander with some room. He fires right on, and Hellebuck able to hold on to that. T.J. Brody for Spezza. Thornton up there as well. Simmons in front. Galchenyuk on the left side. It'll be Spezza firing it. Little puck in front, and... Galchenyuk unable to get a stick on that. Hyman racing after it. Played away by Hellebuck. Shifley back there defensively. Here's a centering pass from Marder. Unable to get a stick on it for a shot. Back to Bogosian. Now Marder's got a great move. Shot off the post. Scores. Looks like Hyman at the end after Austin Matthews banked it off the post. He started in the corner, the first one, and he forces Hellebuck to not get the clearing attempt that he had. Now you've got a couple of puck battles that go the way. Marner with a couple of great plays as he curls this one around a falling Logan Stanley off the post, off the arm, and on the back door. Number 11 sitting right there, but puck finds its way over to Matthews because of that great read by Mitch Marner. Saw at the very end there the battle that was ensuing in front. I don't know how much contact there was between the defender and Hyman to knock him in, but Hyman reaching over Hellebuck would the goalie be able to make the save? And in that case, Hellebuck was looking to his left. I'm not sure he knew where the puck was, but there was definitely contact with Hyman. Michael Markovitz and Eric Furlat, the referees tonight. After further review, the ruling on the ice is confirmed. Therefore, what a good goal. Matthews available on this right side. Kicks it back. Now Nylander from the left flank. In front. And a much pad stop by Hellebuck off Tavares. And Kopp with the clear. Matthews wins the draw. Marner from the high slot. Here's Bogosian in to the net. Still loose. And Hellebuck down to make the stop. So a face-off win and a scoring chance. And now the puck flipped out of play. And that's going to be a penalty. Like he had a lot of room. And Jason Spezza back the other way. Hyman trying to catch up. Pat for Hyman. And Hellebuck with a huge stop on a short-handed leaf chance. Now going back the other way. There's a good effort by Connor putting pressure on Hyman. Up in the air. Pionk gloves it down. It comes outside the line. They'll have to reset out at center. Last time these two teams met, Winnipeg won 5-2. Here's a chance in front. Cop, a stop. Campbell down and is able to cover up. Saved by Hellebuck and then right on the doorstep. That puck was right in play in front. You... Six was a number, though, for the first period. Six shots for Winnipeg. Six shots for Zach Hyman in the opening 20 minutes. Here's Connor with Ehlers on his right side. Nick Ehlers cuts to the middle. Here's the shot. Kicked away by Campbell. Bogosian for Dermott. Up ahead. Here's Mikheyev on the backhand. Cut again. And a stop by Hellebuck as Piak impeded Ilya Mikheyev. For example of your feet with the puck and the good job of Piak coming back and getting a stick in there. 
Alex Kerfoot late in a shift. And Jets with the pressure as it comes back to Pullman. Here's Connor putting it in front and getting the pad down. Sharp angle and off the Riley stick. And covered by Campbell. Back the other way, Tavares. John Tavares, nifty move, and now swings back on Pullman. Morgan Riley moves in, a lead to the net, and that's off the shoulder of Hellebuck of this second jet power play. Shifley caught, didn't get the A shot. Campbell to stop, but Leafs don't get a clear. Stasny for Shifley, and here's Pionk again. Kyle Cotter fires it, and that hit Brody and glanced off his skeet wide. Pionk firing it, loose in front, Cotter shrugged away by Campbell, big stop. And another penalty coming up. Another chance, and Campbell stopped Shifley with Stasny down. Chances for the Jets on that power play. Jack Campbell coming up big, and there's the high stick. 19-18. Kerfoot to the line, but not out. Up down there by Morrissey. Morgan Riley. Morrissey, another stop, but now a break. Here's Kerfoot. Morrissey trying to get back. Alex Kerfoot scores. Short-handed. And the Leafs have a 3-0 lead. Tries to keep this one in. Does a good job of knocking it down. Now it goes once again that Riley throws it up. Now he just loses control of it. And this is just a foot race where you got to give Kerfoot credit. He didn't worry so much of where the puck was. Took a quick little peek. And that's just the quick release up and over the glove. Combination of the speed backing. Look at Hellebuck. He's moving backwards. Down low it goes. Stasny for Connor. Up top, Morrissey, and everything running through Shifley. Morrissey will fire and scores. Power play goal. And Josh Morrissey has two and two against Toronto this season. You're frustrated as a group. Morrissey stays out there, and this is just quick puck movement to the outside. Get some bodies in front. Does Stasny have a much better position? Yeah, look at Campbell. He, he's shaking his head. He never even saw that one come. Good read by Morrissey as he slides laterally to his right. Stasny in the eye. They'll need three to win tonight. As we start the third period, Toronto up by a pair of goals. Galchenyuk for one touch to Brody and back. Nylander to Brody. Galchenyuk one-timer and Hellebuck comes across to make the stop. Neon back to get it in his own zone. Lost it for Nylander's side of the net. Comes out in front and a blocker stopped by Hellebuck. Connor Morrissey, the jet goal scorer, fires it high off the glass. Connor will let him reload. Over to Shifley. Shooting glove stop and Campbell able to get on the rebound. The Jets keep going back to the point, but there's all kinds of little individual battles in front, and Campbell battling the most, trying to find that pass across. Then he got set, and a good job of Hall getting in the stick area of Dubois as he look at, gets out of the way, lets his the goaltender see it, and then the rebound battle in front. Hall's got the stick of Dupuis. Three-point lead in the division over Winnipeg, and a three-team race for first in the north, and the Leafs with a big victory tonight. Just their second in regulation in their last 12 games.